Okay guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Arctic YouTube channel. So in this video tutorial, we will interface our soil moisture sensor with that of the Arduino Uno. The platform we are using is the Proteus Head Professional. So for it, first of all, we will search for our soil moisture sensor. So we will write soil moisture sensor. Okay, now you must have to get in your mind that this soil moisture sensor is not the integral part of the Proteus set. So either you have to download it from Google, you should have to add its library to the library folder of the Proteus. Or if you want to use the same file whose link is given in the description, then you can directly use it. So you just need to click on the link mentioned inside the description and you will just download this file and then you can use it directly okay now now after it we need to take our arduino uno you can also add the arduino uno if you like from google or you can use the same file whose link is given in the description again so we need to connect the power rails or power sources to both of these modules so we will go and we will take power and we will connect the vcc pin of the soil moisture sensor with the power pin then we need to connect ground with the ground so we can press ground here and connect the ground pin of the soil sensor okay now after it we need to sorry we need to connect okay wait we have to shift ground a little bit here so Okay, so we can okay it's not working properly so so we will do one thing that we need to we need to connect some some sort of connector with it like this okay and we can give it a name of like uh, we can say it is H, simple H, okay. Okay, now we also need to connect this H with our A0. So we can take and we can connect. H, simple H, okay. So now this H and this H, now both of these pins are connected with each other. Now after it, we need to connect our serial monitor that is called as the virtual terminal so rxt must be connected with txt and this txt must be connected with the rxt of arduino uno so we will observe all sort of our values our results on the serial monitor okay now we also need to put like some source like dc source with the with the what's called as the input pin of the soil moisture sensor so we will give like 5 volts okay okay now can we run it but is our Arduino is not having any sort of code so it's not it will not work properly so first we will build our code okay now this is our simple code and we okay we we just can we just need to modify it a little and it will work properly so it's our it's the command for the initialization of the serial communication and in while loop we need to declare two variable and analog read and a0 and this 
percent f is equal to map of map of t comma zero comma ten twenty three comma zero comma two fifty five If f is greater than two hundred, then okay. Now, now this is our mapping command that we first we need to read the analog signal on pin A zero. Then we need to store it with the help of this assignment operator inside the variable d. Then variable d needs to be mapped like a map of d. On x axis it is mapped to 1024 and on y axis it mapped to 256 values like it's the resolution like in one second 1024 samples of D are like uh, are, are like uh, we can say that it is uh, observed within one second so if f is then if f is greater than 200 then we can write serial dot print ln moisture content high high okay so so we need to write analog read analog read read must be with capital R okay okay now we need to we need to search for our link of the hex file now this is our link okay so okay now okay wait yeah so we will double click on uh, the sensor then check the attach hierarchy module and then press ok and now now we can see that we have we have some we have nothing on the output of the soil moisture sensor so we need to go to its child sheet okay it's connected with a0 rather than d0 so what we need to do is like this and we need to connect it like this okay with a0 okay so it's written soil moisture content high okay and if you want to low like two volts or like this we will see that nothing will happen so nothing is there so when we will give some higher voltages to the input of the soil moisture sensor so it will give us the soil moisture content high and one more thing that this simulation sensor all the sensors that is soil moisture sensors whose libraries are there for proteus they are like uh, they are not performing just like the original sensor that we use in our hardware so hopefully in our next sessions we will make a simple sensor through which we can give some sort of multiple values so hopefully you got the concept regarding the soil moisture interfacing with the arduino so thanks for visiting our channel